Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your girl Carrabo. Thank you so much for tuning in today to watch this video. I am so excited right now because we just hit 2K. Like, what? That is so crazy. I am so excited. I am speechless right now. I literally like didn't see it coming. When I started this YouTube channel, I just never saw it coming. And like, I just want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for being so supportive, for like sharing my content, for liking, for commenting. You guys know how much I love engaging with you guys. And the more you engage with me, the more I want to make more content, if that makes sense. But thank you guys so much. Oh my goodness. I literally cannot believe it. Thank you guys for coming with me um, throughout this journey and let's see what happens. I'm excited. I'm excited for what's to come. to be showing you guys what I got as a lot of you guys know Pretty Little Thing is honestly one of my favorite brands and Shein is very interesting because I feel like they don't necessarily cater to like people my size it's very hard to find like clothes that fit from Shein that fit like my waist and it's just so hard but they bikinis let me tell you one thing about Shein's bikinis like Okay, so let me start with this bikini I'm wearing right now. It is from Shin and it is a size extra small. If not an extra small, it is definitely a size zero. Bikini is what we would call a um, triangle tie bikini. I would advise everybody who's like on the smaller side, if you're not sure if um, a bikini is going to fit you, to get something that you can tie. If you guys notice, all my bikinis um, actually come with like strings just so like I can tie it to like what I think would fit. The bikini top comes with some padding inside, which is honestly so comfortable and it gives you some sort of structure. It is a three-piece set and I love three-piece sets. Like I love something that's going to like give me some sort of like coverage. back with bikini number two it is also from shin the only thing i can say about this bikini is that it is very cold the rhinestones on the bikini like as i was putting them on i was like <gasps> once again it is a triangle um side tie bikini as you guys can see it's definitely giving me like island vibes i don't know why i guess it's because of these things somehow it reminds me of a coconut I don't know why. <laughs> so the material on this bikini is not your normal um, slinky, um, slimy <laughs> kind of bikini material. Um, it is more of like a waffle um, material, which I don't mind. It still looks pretty. Definitely um, something different to have in the closet. So this is a skirt cover up I got from Shin in a size zero, an extra small. Not really sure. I even think it was on the petite um, section. But it is definitely the smallest size. I love the fact that it has a drawstring as you guys can see here so you can definitely tighten that up um, according to like what your waist size is and yeah I love the fact that it has a slit on the side giving me sexy vibes instead of it being closed off I feel like it would have just been like boring but I love the tassels at the bottom. These are cute. You're a rebel getting into trouble you are kind of like third bikini we are trying on is this one okay i've got three words for this bikini set ready for vacation what okay i i have so many things to say about this but let us start with the dress first of all the back is gorgeous i love it that it's an open back situation you can literally adjust the dress to fit you however you want it to fit you I definitely made it to like be snug on my figure as you guys can see I love the tie-dye material I don't have a swimsuit that is tie-dye so I was like you know what let me go for it it does come with its own underwear and then um, it also has a top as you guys can see so it is a three-piece um, set but yeah so dangerous I get this rush when I'm with you and we've got 
Kardashian's bikini number four. Okay, listen, anything that screams to me, let us go to Miami, I am here for. And this swimsuit set is giving me those vibes. First of all, I'm very disappointed at the fact that um, the cover up doesn't have any loops um, to hold the belt because I feel like it is very easy um, to misplace these or to lose it or something. So you kind of have to like put it on there yourself. The cover up is long. I'm 5'6 and it still like touches the floor. Um, so you can definitely wear some wedge heels with it if you have any wedge heels. I don't have any, but now I feel like I need to go buy some because people are bringing them back in style. I think they were once out of fashion, but like they are slowly coming back. And yeah, I feel like this is definitely um, a set that you'd want to accessorize with. Let me show you guys quickly. Okay, so I probably wear it with um, this hat. I got it from Pretty Little Thing and it was about $40 if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, I definitely think this is a look, this is a vibe with some shades, if you have some shades. I feel like wearing a hat and shades is very distracting, so I either pick one, definitely a hat and a nice handbag or beach bag or whatever it is, and you are ready for that boat. from um, a shin. So this is actually a four-piece um, swimsuit. It has this um, top, which is like a cover, and then it has a skirt. Okay, my battery died there and I had to change it out. So please excuse me if it ever looks like anything is out of place and doesn't seem the way it was before. I definitely apologize. But as I was saying, you could definitely have the bikini top and the skirt, rock it out, Whatever you want to do or just take it out and just have it as a bikini, that is okay. But yeah, I do love um, the skirt shape. It definitely gives um, mini skirt vibes um, and it's not like the other pink swimsuit I tried on first, um, which is more like a sarong, a skirt. Okay, I am bad at explaining, but you guys get <laughs> what I mean. So yeah. Okay, so we are done with Shin and now we are moving on to Pretty Little Thing swimsuits. I will tell you guys, um, Pretty Little Thing is more pricier than Shein is. Um, they do sell their bikinis individually. So instead of this being a set, you'd have to unfortunately buy them um, separately. And usually you would get like $25 for the bottoms and like $25 for the top. So that's what I mean by it is pricey, but they usually do have like a sale and they have like great sales, like 60% off, 40% off, or like 80% off. So just watch out for those. But if it's something that just recently came in, like very brand new to the website, it is going to be pricey. Let's just dive into our first um, bikini. This one doesn't really need much of an explanation except that it does feel good. It is very snug. It was a size zero. So I definitely feel like with Pretty Little Thing, if I do buy like a size zero, it definitely is a size zero and you can um, tell. I don't have to buy like tie strings on the side or anything with Pretty Little Thing because I'm definitely positive that it will fit me. What I like about this bikini is the fact that the top um, is a one shoulder look which I definitely like. It's playful and I love the bottoms being high waist. Yeah, I think the bottoms give um, your body some sort of shape. Um, it definitely highlights your waist and your hips, which I don't have, but <laughs> to those that do. <laughs> bikini set number two for pretty little thing now guys let me tell you this one shuts down the entire bikini collection i show you guys today this is the one that really gives me miami vibes the other one does as well but this one is just i don't want to take it off and you definitely know they did something right if you don't want to take it off let's start off with the material and the quality on this like this was the bikini set I said was expensive. I think the bottoms alone were like $30 and the top was like 25 
and the cover up was like $45 or something like that but I think it nearly cost me about $100 <laughs> so thankfully I do love it because if I didn't I was definitely taking it back to get my money um, but yeah I love it they literally outdid themselves on this I don't know if you guys can see properly but the material it has some gold hints to it I'll definitely try coming up closer so you guys can see but it has like some gold um, texture to it and the texture is awesome the cover up is um, kind of heavy not really that heavy but it is not lightweight which tells you it is not cheap definitely love the bottoms and the top I love that the bottoms are kind of like high waist and the strings are kind of there it definitely um, highlights your body and it gives your body such a nice shape definitely dress this one up um, I would probably wear oh it just fell this hat which I also got from pretty little things the funny thing though is there's two of them so there's like an extremely huge sized one this one is very hard to fit in your suitcase it is nice for Instagram and stuff like that but it is not convenient it is so huge look at this oh my gosh but <laughs> that's how big it is so it is definitely um instagram vibes and that is it you cannot walk around the streets with that hat whereas this one is still big and it gives you that like nice like sun hat straw hat effect and it looks like that but i would definitely wear this um swimsuit with this hat it's a vibe it's a vibe it's a vibe <laughs> I got from Pretty Little Thing is this um, cover up. This I just adore. This I'm ready for the beach. This is giving me whites and vibes. This is giving me Mexico. If only I could go to Mexico. But one day is one day. But the quality on this dress is amazing. Honestly speaking, it is worth it. I think it was $50 or something like that and it is worth every buck. Like the thickness of the uh, material. It is not those thin ones but it is very thick, um, it touches the ground, which is perfect because it doesn't like sweep the floor. But then again, for people who are shorter than me, this is definitely going to be longer than you definitely want it to be. I wish you could have the straps um, adjusted so you could like take it up here if you wanted to. But as seen on the website, the model wearing it, she has it like under the bikini boob. So I'm guessing that's how under the top. <laughs> so I'm guessing um, that's how it needs to stay. OK, and this is the last and final swimsuit I'm going to try from Pretty Little Thing and to end this haul. Now, this is definitely um, a playful, sporty bikini. I think I'd see myself doing something um, sporty in the water, like jet skiing. It's definitely giving me that vibe. I think the buttons are very cute. You can choose whether to button it all up or like halfway button it like I did. I like it this way. I don't know. I just think it's very cute. Pants are a bit loose. Not that loose as in like they're gonna fall off, but I wish them, okay, they are tight when I button it up. but. <laughs> I almost said they didn't fit but yeah it is very cute and you know if you have some boobies a nice cleavage area on here is going to be very dope and if you guys are looking for a cute um, beach bag or straw bag or whatever this is so cute I got it from Shin and it is like $18 $20 or something like that not expensive but it definitely gives your bikinis a nice look but grab your shades and freaking go on vacation don't say i didn't plug you because i just plugged you with multiple swimsuits <laughs> but yeah i'm going to wrap it up now it is the end of my bikini haul i hope you guys enjoyed this video i want to thank you guys so much again for 2000 subscribers and i appreciate each and every one of you guys and yeah, that's it. I guess see you next time.